Did the university send you? Excuse me? Because if they did, they can get lost. <laughs> I have never been so insulted in all my life. Really, laughed at. Balderdash. What are you doing? Are you quite certain you're not a spy? A spy? Those wretches will do anything to destroy me. My theories are correct, and I can prove it. What theories? I am the leading amateur paleontologist in the nation, and not one university will hire me because, unlike them, I actually have ideas. <laughs> You're a what? I study dinosaurs. You know, big lizards. Are they real? Of course they're real, you nincompoop. And everywhere. Everywhere? This state was once a vast, shallow sea that had the most incredible animal that could walk, swim, and fly. Quite unique. I call it Totalisaurus. Just for now. <laughs> um, I'm trying to gather all the evidence. Miss Deborah McGinnis? Arthur. Good to meet you. Uh, could you give me a hand here, please? Of course. Yeah. <coughs> Listen. If you find any of these bones around the country, send them to my homestead at Furwood Rise in Cumberland Forest. Or mail me the locations. I'll reward you handsomely for your efforts. Sure. Why not? And we'll be proving a lot of stuck-up buffoons very, very wrong. Which, trust me, is the very best thing about science. Good day to you, sir! I don't think you should just be wandering around here, friend. Not a thing happens around here without an Adrisco saying so. Understand me? You I'm really serious. shouldn't rile me. Ain't wise. You'll be meeting the Reaper! <laughs> Make him <laughs> Yeah, boy. Yeah! Swan 
Wilson! Reverend, where are you? Hey there, mister. Hello? What's your problem? Reverend! You hear, Reverend? Swanson, you hear me? Come on. Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your God has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him. He's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither, but see, and I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. Oh. Well, how's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? I can't, partners. <laughs> I don't mean to spoil your fun, but I got things to do. You sure? Quite sure. I got to get him out of here. Come on, Reverend, let's get you home. Where'd he go? I don't know. I was talking to you. <sighs> Gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Excuse me, I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure, we saw him, <laughs> smelt him, and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. You crazy? Off him. I didn't say a word. You'll keep. You stay out of it. You want me to kill you? Stop, damn it. Yep, okay, okay. I, I won't Please, tell us. 